it's Natalie and welcome to today's haul. I've got some very exciting items here to show you. So the first one here is actually a planner cover and it's from Sticky Beans. I've wanted this planner cover for such a long time because you guys know that I'm quite the big Harry Potter fan and it came so packaged so nicely. So I'll show you what I got. Oh, <clears throat> I'm going to have to rip it. So, I did get the Marauders Map um, planner cover from Sticky Beans. I think it's gorgeous and you can personalize it with your name and it's on like a um, sort of a satin sheeny paper and it's just so cute and the insides, it says I sell them to wear that I'm up to no good and the back cover says Mrs. Mooney Wormtail Padfoot and Prongs offer their compliments to Professor Snape and request he keep his abnormally large nose out of other people's business and then the back has got um, obviously more of the map of the school and it says Mischief Manage so I love this so much and I'm definitely going to put it on my um, planner cover my planner straight away so there's that and then also with the order there came a cute um, little sticker sheet um, as like a sampler so it's she's got a Facebook group and it's got all these little cat um, stickers on matte paper which are very very cute so there's that and then I she also sends a thank you card with all your orders and I think that's really sweet I love getting thank you cards so there's that and then the next order that I placed is from Planner Kate. So um, this was one of two orders that I placed on Black Friday weekend. I only ordered from Planner Kate and once more with love. So I'll show you what I got from Planner Kate. It's been a very long time since I've ordered from Planner Kate. Um, I think the last time I ordered from Planner Kate was probably like when I first started planning over a year ago. So this is a little sample that came with order. All of Planner Kate's stickers are on removable matte paper. So this is a very nice functional sampler. So you've got like a squiggly divider, this week script header, an arrow, a double dot label, um, a half box with mini checklist with a car in the background, Planner Kate happy mail, a payday icon and these really mini icons that are rounded squares. So there's that. The first thing I got was some Hello Weekend banners, and you'll notice with all of Planner Kate's um, sticker sheets is that she's got um, quite a lot of space on the left side to leave so you can pop this in your binder. So obviously this is for um, the personal planner, these Hello Weekend banners. But then with the other sheets here, you can see that this is designed to put in an A5 binder. So she's even got the guidelines on um, the majority of her sheets as well. So I really like these Hello Weekend banners. I really like the watercolor and the um, script font. And I thought that'd be perfect for my personal planner. I use the So Much Crafting, crafting um, Week on One page with the grid, the grid paper on the left side. So. This is small and little and the hello and the weekend are actually two separate words so you can use them separately or together so i really like those and then i did get um some of these lazy day labels i have i think one or two sheets of these from when i first started planning and i really do like these because i think that because they're a label and they're quite small they're very easy to add in your spread um when you know all of your some of your plans are cancelled and you need to replace them with a lazy day sticker so there's those and i do like her color selection she's got two types of pinks which is nice grays purples um a lot of blues greens oranges and um, a coral here which is very pretty and a lilac so there's the lazy day stickers and before i get into all the double dots i purchased i'll show you the other item that's not the other items that are not double dots because let's be honest i really just placed this order to get stock up on double dots so the I purchased four sheets of the sick day stickers and as you can see they've got the um, the binder punch guide on the side and these I purchased for the exact same reason as the lazy day stickers because I think these are very small um, very simple and functional and are great to pop at the top of your day or over plans when they're cancelled when you have a sick day so I did pick up four of these because these are my favorite sort of six day stickers. So again, it's the same color palette. She does have her standard color palette, but with this one, you've got um, the navy included as well as the gray. 
So I've purchased four sheets of those. And then the um, last item um, that's not double dots are these Dr. Label stickers. I just think they're simple and functional and I really don't have anything that's simple and fu functional to mark doctor's appointments. I've just got like larger icons. So I really like these and you can get the same color palette. And then I did get some double dots. So on Black Friday, she did have 30% off. So what I decided to do was just go through all the double dots she's got because she has the... Um, 2015 to 2016 Erin Condred monthly color double dots. She also has the 2016 to 2017 um, monthly colored item double dots. And then she also has the ones for the horizontal planner, which were from last year. So the double dots in the monthly colors from last year, the 2015 to 16 planners were marked down 30% off already. And then I also got a further 30% off because, um, of the Black Friday sale. So mostly I bought those and then I did from the 2016 to 2017 monthly color scheme, I just got um, a few months that I thought were um, colors that were I would use a lot. So I, I, I think I definitely got February and the May, like the pinks and the peaches and um, the teal. So colors that I use quite frequently. And then um, I also got some of her multicolor sheets. So I'll go through what I purchased. So this is just a purple color scheme. I believe this is um, November. So um, it's November in one of the planners, but I thought this was nice. I definitely use purple and I just love the double dots. They're just like a favorite label. I love how they've got squared edges. So when you're putting them in the planner, you don't have to worry about washi or if you're trying to cover up something, it's just very easy to just use. Um, so these are the February colors. I believe this is for next year's planner. Um, and I thought that this peachy shades were really pretty. So I did purchase this one. Then I also got these April colors. Um, I did like all the shades of yellow and then almost these two are sort of a beige. And these are some September colors. So I really like the teal and the green in here. And then I did get the old November colors because I love those colors. The beige is very nice and then all the blues. And then you'll see that I've already used some of these. So um, these are some October colors um, in the new planner. So um, this was just a navy sheet and you can see that I've already used these. Um, I did use them in my um, glam planner white Christmas planning with me and I was so grateful that I purchased these because I honestly do not know what I would have used if I didn't have these because that kit was black white and then a very deep navy so I pretty much use all of those for that um then I also picked up four sheets of the multicolor so um again it's the same color scheme so you can see that this is her standard color palette and I definitely picked up the multicolor items just in case there were any other items that any other color double dots that I um, needed would need but I didn't have in the monthly colored sheets that I picked up so um, love these and you can see that I've already used some of the grays and navy so there are four of these and then um, the next sheet that I got was the old October color double dots I thought this would be great for um, all those autumn spreads and anything I need orange for. And then the brown, you never know, it might be in a spread sometime. Um, then I also picked, I think these are the new July colors. Um, I liked all the, like the sea foam greens and everything in the mint. Then I know that these are the, are these the old February colors? Um, might be some of the new ones as well. So um, the burgundy and the pinks. So, and very, very rosy pink here. So I will definitely use those. And then I know that these are the old January colors, the orange and the teals and the blues and the mint, which is really pretty. Um, then these are old August colors, the green and the yellows. Um, so you've got a very like um, mustardy yellow here and some greens. And then I know that these are the old March colors. So you've got deep greens and lighter greens. And then finally, the old September colors with the grays and the purples. So that's everything that I purchased from Planner K, and I love those double dot labels. Um, leave a comment down below what sort of label stickers that you like to purchase, um, because I'm interested in finding other shops that have label stickers, not, not like that are squared edges, because um, their labels are definitely my favorite stickers to use in my planner. So let me know which ones that you use. So 
Um, the next item that I've got here is the Planner Envy Get Organized November Mystery Kit, which I absolutely love. So I'll show you what's inside. Um, I pick mine up in Glossy and she announces when her in mystery kit is releasing on her Instagram page. So um, here she always wraps everything up really nicely and personalizes everything. It says, Dear Nat, be fearless, be brave, be bold and love your spot. So I love this. Um, and she also included the freebie, which I love this freebie. I've showed it on my channel before. I especially love this here, sticker here with like two friends. They're taking a selfie. Very cute. And this is the November mystery kit. And I absolutely adore leopard print. And I think this kit is so fun, but chic at the same time. And I'm very, very excited. So the first page here, you get um, seven full boxes. And this one here has got this really chic girl with leopard print um, glasses on. And she, the quote is, as far as I'm concerned, leopard isn't your choice. I think it is. And then you've got these leopard print um, and stripes with gold glitter. And I think it's gorgeous. Then you've got some labels of washi strips here and then some third boxes which are very nice and then on the next page you also have some more um, third boxes half boxes and then quarter boxes and then you do have some mini checklists here and then this is these are like top tasks for the day boxes here and then these are the check boxes that come in the kit which I think are really really cute so um, you have um, uh, the Starbucks cup the girl um, perfume bottle, lipstick and um, some sandals as the checklist and I think that's really fun and cute and I especially love these gold glitter check boxes here. Then you have some little bullet points in hearts and asterisks and then you have two little planners here and then you've got some um, funny um, scripts, script icons. You've got must plan tonight, whoops, brought new stickers, must plan tonight, post my bomb planner spread, the same one and then the same ones again in different colours. I think that's so funny and very cute. Then the next page also has some, uh, th well, six mini, not six, nine um, mini heart checklists. I just love this gold glitter. It's really nice. And then you also have um, all of these blue point dots. And then you've got some horizontal flags in the glitter. And then some more in um, the solid colors in the kit. And then you do have some eight, che eight um, full checklists. And then eight mini checklists, which I love. And I really like how they're not check flags. They just um, go straight down the box. I usually prefer that. And then the next page has all the headers. So you've got seven to today to do little things headers. Then you also have seven work headers. Um, then you have three, six, nine, twelve, eighteen label stickers. And I love these. And then you also have some other headers here. So you've got two remember, do not forget, cancelled, not today, pop fizz, clink, and next week. And I really like the font. I think it matches the kit really well. And then this page, you have all of your little things. So you have eight meals, four um, birthdays or celebrations, um, four um, to call little things, four groceries or shopping, eight TVs, two paw prints, um, a haircut, manicure, uh, six asterisks, um, to like bill dues or credit cards or payday, um, a vacuum cleaner, car wash, and two um, washing machine little things. So great variety there. Then this page has all of your icons. Then you have another quote box that says be you and be fierce, which I love. You get four habit trackers, a note sticker for your sidebar, two date nights, and two bill dues, which I love how she does these. Hashtag adult life, and she puts a little decorative icon in there. Very cute. Then the next page you have the washi. So you've got this leopard print bottom washi with the gold glitter and the background's pink, which is gorgeous. Then you have a thin strip of this gold like confetti glitter. Then you have two weekend banners, which are like these little balloons, a balloon alphabets. Um, alphabets which is very cute then you got some deco you got a lipstick Starbucks um, coffee um, perfume bottle and a little flower and then this page here you've got some extra headers or washi strips or um, labels you can use them for whatever you like these definitely look like they're a header size so you've got some glitter headers down the bottom as well and then you've got all this deco which I love um, you've got um, all this beautiful deco now polish lipstick Perfume, margaritas, the big girl here, all very girly things, and I love the planner tassel as well. 
And the last page um, are the date covers. So you've got the date covers here and her date covers say hump day and Friday instead of Wednesday and Friday. Um, then you've got all these date dots, which I really like. Then you've got some Planet and we go Happy Mail Trackers. And then a um, December Mystery Kit um, Tracker. Some labels here with the gold glitter. I really like that. And then you've got some decorative icons down the bottom. So you've got a treat yourself, nails, Friday, lazy day, payday, um, another payday, and lazy day. So I absolutely adore that mystery kit. I definitely think that her mystery kits are incredible value for money. Um, and I highly recommend that you pick them up. I just purchased the December one, and it's beautiful summer themed mystery kit. So I'm very excited to receive that one. And the next shop that I've got an order in from is from a La Petite Paula. I'm sure you've seen um, me talk about a shop on the channel before. Um, it came packaged in this really cute little paper bag with um, a sticker of her logo. And I'm very excited about this order. So, um, the first item that I got is these little um, Buy Diet little stickers. She actually popped this in the order as well. I think they're hilarious. And um, the little cat. I think this is an actual character. But I'm not sure what the character's name is. It says by diet. I think these are so funny. Um, I purchased uh, three of these little seashell sticker sheets because um, I am going on a cruise and it's summer. And last year, well, it's not last year yet when I'm filming this. It's still December, but. Um, Earlier this year when I went away on holiday, I ended up using a lot of these um, stickers when I was journaling um, my um, holidays away at the beach. So I picked these up again and I picked up three of them so I didn't run out and all those stickers are on a thin matte paper which is very nice and her print quality is very lovely and um, she is based in Spain so um, the shipping is very inexpensive to Australia and I would assume that if it's inexpensive to Australia, it's inexpensive to everywhere else in the world. And this isn't also another like marine life sheet that I had last year um, that I finished and I wanted to pick it up again to journal my um, holiday spreads this year because I'm going on a cruise for the Pacific Islands. So I love this. It's got, um, you've got some crabs and lobsters, seashells, um, octopus, starfish. Um, and some coral so I really like that and then I also she also popped in these little um, this little sweet sheet which I think is really pretty you've got some coffee cups and hot chocolates and mugs and some little cupcakes and cakes and I think this is so cute it's very um, autumnal sort of a sticker sheet so um, I'll definitely use that in autumn which is very cute and then this is definitely an autumn themed kit uh, autumn themed sheet it's very pretty deco sheet with some autumn leaves and pumpkins and scarves and really pretty florals so there's that um, and then I also got two sheets of these reminder stickers so um, reminder little circle labels and I think that these are really nice and functional and I do like these a lot especially my personal planner so the top row um, they say do this um, the second row is to clean and then the third row says main task which is the one that I'm most excited for um, and then these ones are just plain so you can use them for anything so this is the pastel set and then this is the bright set so I really like that you can see the printing on these is very good quality so really like those and then I also picked up some full boxes so I really love these full boxes these are um, I think these are her Moroccan full boxes and I just think they're absolutely beautiful. So obviously it's very Moroccan like tile theme and I think it's gorgeous. So I cannot wait to do a spread with these. Um, probably use this in my journaling planner so I can bring in um, lots of glitter and um, use some washi tape. And I think these are so pretty. Then I also got these makeup and beauty full boxes because obviously they're definitely right up my alley. So you got two quote boxes. This one says, live, laugh, love, and makeup um, with a Chanel empty perfume bottle with some makeup brushes in it. And then this one has some lashes. It says, makeup is art, beauty is spirit. And then you've got this girl in her bathroom. She's going out putting on her makeup. This one's got lips, lipsticks, um, Chanel makeup haul. Um, this girl is putting on her lipstick and she's got her sunglasses. And this one's putting on her makeup. Up, um, sitting on the bed so I really really like those and then I also got these breakfast at Tiffany's full boxes which I think are really beautiful and very chic and elegant so you've got um, Audrey Hepburn 
um, as Holly Go Lightly in the movie, and then the quote box says, nothing is impossible, the word itself says I'm possible. So very, very pretty. And then I also ordered some of her new chibis. So first off, um, I did pick up her Christmas chibis. Um, you'll probably see this after this whole after Christmas is over, but um, I love these little chibis. I love the cat ears. I think they're so cute. So um, I picked them up in, I picked the chibis up in like Eve, Shay, and maybe Ma Maria or Maura. Um, I don't really mind what skin color and hair color they have. I just pick what's available. Um, so like I was saying, these are the Christmas ones. So you've got um, girl in a Christmas outfit baking Christmas cookies um, with her candy cane, um, putting, um, setting up the tree. And so you've got the four big sizes and then you've got the smaller sizes there. So I think they're really cute. And then this is the second Christmas sheet. Oh my God, I put this in my water. Whoops. Um, um, so you've got a uh, Christmas wrapping. So she's like suffocated by the wrapping, which is funny. Christmas shopping, I'm um, building a snowman. And then I'm not sure what she's doing in this one. Maybe like partying as a Christmas elf, but yeah, look, very cute. And then I picked up some Happy Mail chibis, which I think are adorable. So she's like outside picking up her envelope of Happy Mail, very cute. Then the next sheet I picked up um, is a baking girl, and I love her little um, baking hat. Then I picked up the uh, reading chibis, which are adorable. And then I also have another Happy Mail one. Um, then I picked up the photography chibis, very cute. And then I picked up the like relaxing lazy day chibis, because we all love the lazy day. And um, this is the hairdresser, or like doing your hair, chibi girl. So I love that one. And then this was like, I think this is like twin love or something. Um, but I think you can use it if you're going out with your best friend. So very cute. And then I picked up the Disney one, which I think is adorable. Um, she's like in her Minnie Mouse outfit and so cute. And then I just picked up these, I think this is called Good Day. So just having a nice stroll, enjoying yourself. And then I also picked up these other reading ones. So I think these are so cute. And I'll show you the difference in skin colors. So like I was saying, I think this is Maria. And then this is Shay and Eve. So Eve's got more of like a pink tone, fair complexion. Um, Shay has got... Um, more of like a yellow toned, like darker complexion than Eve. And then um, Maria has um, obviously a darker complexion than all of them, but they've all got brown hair. So I don't mind which one of these I get. Um, I think they're all really cute. And she also has um, some others in different skin tones and different hair colors. So um, whatever you look like, there should be one for you, uh, but they're all super cute anyway. And then the most exciting thing in this order is my little chibi book and I think these are so cute so you can see how small these are um for those of you I think I had someone um ask me on Instagram if they had fit in a traveler's notebook and I actually don't have a traveler's notebook I think they're really cute but I don't have one but I could I guess I could tell you how small they are in comparison to like a personal planner so this is my personal Kiki K and I guess it spans, it just fits inside the rings. Um, I don't have a ruler here that, um, oh no, I do. I've got one in centimeters. I thought I only had my Erin Condren, which um, is in inches and I do not understand inches at all. Um, so um, it is 12.5 centimeters long and the width is probably 8.75. So I hope that helps, well, almost maybe nine. Um, I hope that helps with you um, planner girls that have a traveler's notebook to see if that will fit. Um, but I will double check. I'll look up some dimensions online and ask some friends that have traveler notebook and I'll pop it up on the screen if it will fit in there um, and in what size, if they're different sizes. So um, this is the chibi book. You can choose it in any of the chibi characters that you want. I believe this is Shay. And it's very cute. It's like cardboard and then a staple together. And I think it's adorable. So um, 
this you like. So the front cover here um, just says let's plan and then it's got the chibi girl that you chose on the front. So this is Shay, very cute. And I'll go through what it contains. So the first page here has some crying chibis, some photography chibis and then movie time cinema chibis. Then the next page has some sleeping chibis and a baking cooking chibis. Then this page has some like computer chibis or um, like Netflix bins you could use these for. And then there are some spa day which are very cute. Then you've also got some workout or running chibis, some shopping chibis and then cleaning chibis. I'm definitely not that excited when I'm cleaning. Um, then over here you've got some payday chibis some great and some grocery shopping chibi girls then you have um the lazy day girls then you've got these working ones she's crying a bit um then here you've got some hairdressing appointment ones then sick day and then um this could be like going to university or school because she's holding a book or um, many other things. And then on the last page here you've got some um, bath time girls and then some happy mouth chibis. And then here it just says thank you. And then on the back it just says La Petite Paula, um, the chibi again. And then her Instagram, La Petite Paula Shop, her Facebook group and then the her website. So the... Chibi books are only available on her website, but she's also on Etsy for everything else. So I'll leave a link down below. And um, I also wanted to mention that I am on her PR team. So I do have a coupon code for 20% off um, on her site and her Etsy. So yeah, I'm very excited about this book. I was, uh, that was the most, the thing that I was most excited about. So um, I really hope that you enjoyed this whole um, please like and subscribe to my channel and follow me on Instagram at Aversa Scribbles and make sure to check out all the shops down below. I'll leave them linked in the description box and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!